Hi, uh, my name is Izzy. Um, the project is with Tame Power and Music Magazines for our media course work. Uh, the genre of music I'm doing is alternative indie rock kind of stuff. Um, yeah. So the drawn drafts we were given these sheets that had like empty boxes on them. We were told to draw. I think it was two front covers, two condensed pages, and four double pages, just as like a the base thing that we were gonna use. Um, and I did the front cover, two of the front covers, and the contents pages. I think I did alright on those. And then in one of the double pages, I messed it up because I drew the the subject in the middle of the page where it would have folded over, which wouldn't have worked. So I scrubbed it out and I moved it to the side. Um, but apart from that it was, I think it did okay. I put some colour on it, did colour schemes at the top. Um, <clears throat> the digital drafts I did on Photoshop. Uh, I just used pictures from Google, like I googled um, like silhouettes of people and uh, backgrounds, different fonts, downloaded some different fonts um, and I just made what I thought I should make my front cover to look like, which I've again put into the final pieces to to make it look like what I designed. Um, yeah, I just I did that. I did one with uh, just one subject in the in the front cover, which is the one that I'm using. And then I did one where it was I think it was three people, but I didn't use that. Um, poses and costumes again. I just got pictures from Google of artists that I already know of because they're all quite similar like they dress in, in a similar way um, and I did we had to do eight um, like little categories things and then four pictures for each and I did I can't remember all of them but I did shoes instruments facial expressions hair um, I think clothing colour or something like that, I can't even remember, but I did those um, and then we had to do little annotations for them, like how we were going to put them into our work <clears throat> and just what was going on in the pictures that was similar to each other and how it was like linked, but yeah. Um, double page article, I got, uh, did that on Photoshop or PowerPoint, I can't remember which one, uh, I just wrote an article off the top of my head, uh, we had to come up with like a like a name for the person that we were gonna, we had to be either an interview or like a Q and A Q&A kind of thing. Um, yeah, I did that. I used again. I used silhouettes. I found on Google uh, fonts, little boxes to make it look how a normal double page would in an actual magazine. Uh, content analysis we did on PowerPoint. Uh, this was when we had to do. I think it was like five features, five cover lines, ten articles, I can't, I can't remember properly, but um, something like that. Um, and we put them into like what we would put in to our contents page basically. And an editor's note, which we had to just, just write off the top of our heads basically. Uh, camera techniques video, we got put into groups and we went outside and then inside we use we all got a chance to use the camera um, <clears throat> and we just had to do all the different camera techniques that there are and just kind of make examples so there was one I think it was steady camera handheld one of them and we would we just all had to run and then the person holding the camera just had to like chase us as if we were like in a, a zombie film or something and then the one I was doing was I had to stand at a door and say two shot because there was two of us and we just said it and yeah. Uh, the photography shoots were good. I brought in this coat to use and a yellow hat. Um, the pictures at first were a bit terrible because I, I just wasn't holding the camera properly. Um, there was too much of the background and not enough of the, the person so I had to like move stuff around and tell them to like where to go and stuff and then I learned how to actually use the camera properly and then I got some really good pictures out of it.
but yeah.